Hey guys, it's Joe from Mattress Clarity. Today I'm going to be doing another review. We have the Lumen Leaf mattress. I'm gonna be running this mattress through a number of tests. I'm gonna be telling you what I like about it, what I don't like about it, giving lots of good detailed information. Basically, by the end of the video, you're gonna know if this is the right fit for you. So sit back, relax, and let's have some fun. We'll do a quick overview here, but before we do that, if you have any detailed questions or you want me to give you a personal recommendation, all you have to do is leave a comment below. So we have the Lumen Leaf mattress. This is a memory foam mattress. It is the second uh, product offering from Sattva. They have a traditional spring mattress. This actually looks a lot um, like that mattress, but it's a very, very different feel. Has some very high quality memory foam in it. So I was excited to jump in and give it a try. Let's talk about the construction of this mattress. Again, we have the relaxed firm version here. Starting with the cover, uh, it's a nice soft cover. It is organic cotton and it's also quilted. So it has some nice softness at the very top of the mattress. First layer is uh, two inches of gel memory foam. It's four pound density. It's also convoluted. So there's actually places where air can escape. So it's gel infused and with the convolutions, that's two different ways how you're gonna sleep cool with this mattress. Then also on the middle third of the mattress, there is gel laminated on top of that layer. So there's actually three ways that you'll sleep cool with this mattress. Underneath that memory foam layer is another two inches of memory foam. It's a very high density, five pound memory foam. So you have four inches of memory foam that will give you that classic memory foam feel. It's pretty slow to react, but it should have very good pressure relief. Underneath that is a transition layer, which basically transitions you from the softer comfort materials to the firmer layers underneath it. Um, then we have the base um, polyfoam layer, which is pretty standard base layer for, for an all foam mattress. So overall, you have a nice classic memory foam feel that should have great pressure relief. It's three different ways that you're gonna sleep cool. And um, I think the, uh, the materials are pretty high quality, um, should be durable, especially given this price range as well. So very good uh, construction overall. Let's talk about firmness and feel. Firmness wise, I think this is about a six and a half, seven out of 10, with 10 being the firmest. Uh, you have some initial softness. There's a quilted cover with some very soft foam in there. Then the memory foam layers underneath it. It feels a little bit firm initially, but then the memory foam kind of kicks in and uh, relieves pressure after that. So I think it's about a six and a half out of 10. I'm also gonna bring in Martin from our team, who's bigger than I am to offer a different perspective. So as far as feel is concerned, this has that classic memory foam feel. So you can see when I push my hand away, it slowly returns to form. Uh, so that's that very classic memory foam feel. Um, it makes it, it's a little bit harder to uh, move around in the mattress, um, but it's also good for motion isolation, which I'll test later on as well. I'm gonna talk through how I feel in different sleeping positions. When I lie down on my back, I feel some initial softness. I feel the memory foam slowly getting to work. It definitely has that classic memory foam feel. Uh, you don't sink in too much, so it's kind of a balance of sleeping on the mattress, that feel versus sleeping in the mattress. It's right in the middle there. Uh, it's a, a nice match uh, for me support-wise on my back. So I'm gonna come down on my side now. I do feel like it has good pressure relief. You might feel some initial firmness, but that goes away as the memory foam gets to work. So I, I feel like it's, uh, it's about a six and a half, seven for me, um, and has some pretty good pressure relief. Um, when I come on my stomach as well, uh, same sort of opinion I have uh, as on my back. Uh, I sink in a little bit. I think maybe if you just sleep on your stomach, you want something a little bit firmer. But for me, I thought it was a nice match as well. I'm gonna give you a visual representation of where you might feel pressure on this mattress. I've got a pressure map here. I'm gonna lie down on my back, side, and stomach, and you're gonna see anywhere from low pressure, blue, all the way up to red for high pressure. Let's get started.
Hey guys, Martin here to offer a different perspective. Uh, Joe is 5'9", 160. I am 6'7", 230, so definitely a different body type. Um, he felt it was a 6.5 or 7 firmness. I felt it's about a 7.5. Uh, like Kim, definitely some slow compression when you're lying on your side um, for my size. Uh, at first I felt it was pretty firm, but as I laid on a little bit longer, I was sinking more in, and about four inches you can really kind of feel that, uh, that give and that uh, pressure relief. On my back and my stomach though, I did feel my hips and sinking in on both sides. So if you're my size and a back or stomach sleeper, you might want to look for something a little bit firmer. Let's talk about motion isolation or motion transfer. Basically, if you sleep with a partner and they move around on their side of the bed, you want to know if that motion transfers over to your side of the bed. So I've got a glass here. I'm going to move around <coughs> near this glass. And you can see that the glass is barely moving at all. I've got memory foam in this mattress, so I expect it to do quite well, and that's definitely the case here. So I think this isolates motion quite well. It could be a good option for couples. Let's talk about edge support, which is important if you sleep with a partner or just want to use the full surface area of the bed. So I'm on the edge here. You can see the foam here is collapsing. It's an all foam mattress, but I feel like I could tie my shoes pretty easily without any issue. I come down towards the edge of the bed here, and I don't really feel like I'm going to be ejected from the bed, so I feel like the edge support is Definitely like a little bit better than average, I would say. I'm gonna talk through some of the pros or who I think this might be a good fit for. This does a very good job of sleeping cool. So memory foam owners typically complain about sleeping hot and this mattress definitely addresses that quite well. The other thing I really like is pressure relief. If you're on your side, you may feel some initial firmness, but then the memory foam gets to work and the pressure goes away. So I feel like this is a very good option for side sleepers. And I think they use very high quality components that should be durable, especially in this price range. So I think the value is really here with this mattress. Um, these components you would see in a store for like $2,500, $3,000. So the value is really here with this mattress as well. I'm gonna go over some of the cons or who I think this might not be the best match for. To me, this is about a six and a half, seven out of 10 on the firmness scale. And they do have a, a comfort level option that's even firmer. So if you're looking for a soft mattress, I would probably look elsewhere. This is also a very classic memory foam feel. There's not a lot of bounce to it. It's not very responsive. Um, it's harder to reposition yourself. So just make sure you understand the type of feel that you're looking for. Uh, lastly, I think if you're a heavier sleeper and you sleep just on your stomach or back, you might want something with a little bit less memory foam, maybe something a little bit firmer, maybe even going just to the, uh, the firmer version of this mattress. So to wrap up, the Lumen Leaf mattress is definitely very comfortable. The memory foam takes a second or two to kick in, then relieves pressure very well, especially when you're on your side. It definitely has a luxurious feel as well, the very quality components. I would have expected the price to be higher than it is, so I think the value is really there. I think they've done a great job of addressing the issue of sleeping cool as well. The only thing I would caution you on is just understanding what the memory foam feel is. And if you're heavier, I think if you sleep on your stomach or back, you might want something a little bit firmer. So that's basically it. Um, if you're just getting started with your research, we have some top picks on our website. Just Google Mattress Clarity Best Mattress. And certainly let me know if you have any questions.